Here's how to change the corner styles of whatever object that you've created. Notice that this one has rounded corners and by default I've got just the squared off corners. First of all, select the object that you want to affect, then look at the top middle of your tool options box. This area allows you to quickly change up the corner options. If I click the down arrow you can see these are some different predefined ones and rounded is the most commonly used one that we have. With rounded selected, Notice that I've got little small rounded corners for each of the different edges now. To change how much it's going to be rounded off, keep it selected and change the number within here. So let's make it something dramatic like 0.75. When I hit return, now you can see it rounds them off. Another thing you can do is you can tell the object to only have specific rounded corners or to change up each one to be slightly different. To do this, I'm going to hold down my Option key and click on this icon. When I do this, it brings up my Corner Options dialog box. Now by default, whenever you choose a Corner Options styling, it's going to style all four of them. This dialog box will allow you to style each one individually, and you can tell what, which one is going to be styled by the little marker on each edge. Make sure the little link has been unchecked so that you can change each one individually. So let's say I wanted this top left one to be none, this bottom left one to be none, and this top right one to be rounded will keep it and say this bottom right one will be inverse rounded. Now you can see what it's looking like as I'm building it out. Make sure preview is checked off and you can also change up how rounded you want it to be. So if this one wants to be 0.25, we'll say OK. And that's some more advanced techniques on using the rounding of a frame that you've created.